amazing like i'm super excited to come here to show you guys how beautiful potakot is yes even the water side guys because this is where our fresh seafood comes from i mean people who bring fresh seafood from different parts of different villages into potakot through this beautiful river okay guys now just enjoy the view of my beautiful city potakot city <laughs> Wow. So guys, this market is called Creek Road Market and this is the path of the river where the fishermen that bring in seafood stuff from nearby villages offload their market. Okay, I didn't come early. Yes guys, I would have shown you guys how they do their offload. So from here, I went straight into the market but first I had to look for a POS person to withdraw money from. So guys, these bags you see here are full of crabs and some other sea food. This is how they store them after they offload them from the river or from the water side rather. I just was saying that maybe now when they bring them from water. Sir, which stop is this one? Eh, Napama. So, Sammy, give me two one five now. Now, because I really want to buy a bag. Make I take. Thank you. So guys, this part of the market is called St. Jude's. The market is so big that they had to name each street, okay? So um, whenever you come to Creek Road Market, just ask anyone of what you want to buy or tell them what you want to buy so they will tell you the actual street to go to so you don't end up walking around the whole big market. Here, I'm actually looking for the women that, you know, um, sell this seafood um, stuff. They sit in a particular area. I almost got confused. <laughs> I had to ask as well and I was told. So, my dear beautiful people, seafood in Pothakot, no be joke. <laughs> I mean, this fish, she told me 50,000 naira. Eh? See the way I gingerly and wirely dropped it? <laughs> oh my god, she actually said 45,000 naira last. So, guys, I need to overdo myself. <laughs> That's my fish is actually cut. Um, I went for the medium size, I be the small size of it of this particular fish. Uh-huh. Um that's actually it. 
on the floor i mean inside that uh, black rubber cover so guys that's the second one she's cutting i got three of it three of this size of fish for ten thousand naira and i must say guys it's actually a very good buy considering how expensive things are right now in nigeria and seafood is not even a joke okay so my beautiful people i would definitely make a very yummy delicacy with this fish i mean river state native soup watch out for that post <laughs> Whereby if this two people are not there, you figure the least thing. So guys, I got one kg. I mean one kg of tiger prawns for 7,500 naira. <laughs> I mean, things are really, really expensive. This used to be um, 5,000, 5,500 if I'm not mistaken. And man, it's well. <laughs> That's all I can say. Okay. So my beautiful people, the lady also packed the tiger prawns head for me. I mean, it's not a waste. <laughs> I'm going to be using it to make a very lovely sauce for my family on Easter Sunday morning. Now I've given you another reason to stay glued to Becky the Mommy's channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do subscribe and ring the notification bell so you will get notified whenever i drop a new post now guys directly opposite the lady i saw this yam zone and man the yams were looking good although i didn't plan buying yams it wasn't in my list but then again i just had to buy <laughs> they look so good so now this yam now this yam one one of this yam now one seven Eh? That's what you know me, so I give you. Now, so, now, so, Nigeria, I don't buy. <laughs> How much I send him for? You know, what I send him for? Eh? How much I buy there? You put this small one, the 800. Yeah, give me, give me one, one, three. Yeah. Yeah. And then I buy that. So, this one, if you get that, this one, 30, you don't call it 20. Yeah. The 800. You put the 800, no be 30, no be 2. 30, if you get that, this one, 30, you don't call it 20. Yeah. <laughs> okay guys so i stood my ground and i paid him the exact three thousand three hundred naira i was bargaining for the yams and he sold it yes now that's to say i got each yam for a thousand one hundred naira instead of the one thousand four hundred naira he was insisting on and that was actually a very good buy so from here i headed up straight to another section of the market to look for crayfish and dry fish in fact everything dry seafood is sold in this part of the market and also snail <laughs> yeah so this is where i got snail Auntie? from good afternoon hi they sell snail A big one. Hmm. Hmm. And the crazy. Look at my money, they do. My money, I finish work. 
So guys, she gave me this um six big size of snail for two thousand naira instead of the four she initially mentioned and the good thing i love about this market is the women they clean um whatever you buy from them i mean the um, fresh seafood um stuff they always clean it by themselves if you want them to clean it okay without any extra cost okay so all i did was just stand and watch them clean my stuffs and then i paid for the snail and took it and from here i went to look for dry crayfish and um, dry fish i mean raw fish <laughs> why they say crayfish my name baby this if i don't bring my half you all want that you all want that why they say which are the crayfish this one for which rubber this one I want four. I can not I can not go I I I'm making sense for the sass in the hookah. Uh-huh, and when you go, you go grab them. You know go fish if that have been good because I don't walk. Sister, again, don't carry your costume. I know I'm through you. Why, of course. Don't carry your costume. I'm not through you. No, I'm not I don't price it on there for that one now. You know, they, you know, that's when they do for 1,000. So this one, how much last? <laughs> that one, I'm not too fast. Too fast for this one? Yes. Too fast for this one? Yes. No, 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 I won't buy from your hand and see. Make I come. Make I measure, ready to sell. Which one? Bring my waterproof. I'll give you 2000 I beg. For this one. Oh, yeah, how much last you won't give me? Mommy, remove something. Now. You I don't remove. Now, two, two five. I don't come out. That's what they do. Sit down, shift that this one and finish up. I don't feel that. See, I'm for bad. That's how they do it. I'm a major way for you. Ganama's good. Auntie, I tell you, they press this thing inside when they measure it. Oh, today, not today. Ma, good afternoon. I want a goose. Now this one the um, hand. Now this one. 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 How much last? That one, how much? Let me cost that big one. Five thousand. This one, I have four, five. This one, uh, that's half of. That's this one, half. So if you need one, where your money no reach this one, buy this one. If your money reach, buy this one. Let me see. So which one, where your money reach? I want better than that, but I want me a move on for me. The middle one. Try the last. For this time. I won't cry. I don't cry. Don't yet. cry. This is too close. I won't cry. Ah. How much I carry come market? I know people point out that I don't buy inside. This is too close. Everything costs my picking. 
I'm going to move money from me now. I'm going to give you 100 now. I'm going to give you 5 I'm going to give you 2 3. I beg. 2 3, I beg. I think that they say if I come to uh, this market, now I go buy things. Buy cheap food. This one, I feel like that. I say marry no. Me? Five years for marriage. As I as I get three children. How many? Three. How many children? The lady screamed when I told her I have kids. I mean, I get this reaction from people all the time. Eh? I know I don't look like I've given birth to one, okay? Talk more of two. <laughs> so I get this reaction from people all the time. So guys, this was actually the um, place where I got dry fish from. This was the last thing I got from this section of the market. So guys, is in this section of the market you would see different type of dry fish. I mean, <laughs> in surplus different types, okay? And um there is this particular type of fish we use here in River State for traditional weddings. Yes, this fish. Ah, we don't joke with it, especially the Ikwere people okay uh but the fish i got is a um, boar fish yes this one it's called boar fish it is nice i mean very nice in native soups and i also use it in making yam pepper soup proper equerry yam pepper soup <laughs> a portion of this boar fish guys is 4500 naira <laughs> and they also have it in cards but this is the one that i got so from here i went to look for on right plantain but i stopped here to buy guinea corn and yellow corn yes i'll be using them to process pap for my kids guys i love processing pap for my kids at home myself okay and i'll be showing you guys how i'll be doing this particular set okay so uh my phone died at this point exactly when i was buying the yellow corn so i couldn't capture when i got the unripe plantain and the um, gary yeah <laughs> so this is just me you know offloading everything i got from the market and putting them in their right places okay um so guys yeah this is um semo i like having at least about two or three type of swallow at home okay so guys um i actually got tired and exhausted after arranging i just you know put the fresh um stuffs inside the freezer that's why they look like this right now and i slept i got home like around um around one yeah so i slept and i by the time i woke up i brought out everything again to you know show you guys everything i got from the <laughs> market so this is a perewinko this is a little bit of meat i got to add to the soup i want to make this is the fish okay yeah so um this is the war fish the dry war fish and as well um stockfish i got this stockfish at a very good price i must say and i love getting stockfish that have enough you know enough flesh <laughs> not just head okay guys so this is crayfish um the other one is dry pepper this is fresh pepper and um, a little bit of onions that i got to add to the ones i have this is obono i got this obono for 1000 naira i'll be making soup as well with it and that's a greasy and this is cocoa yam <laughs> i'm going to be using it for the native soup i talked about this is palm oil so guys this is practically everything i got from potaco sea food market so my darlings I'm sure you enjoyed watching this video. See how sweaty I am already. <laughs> I'm sure you enjoyed watching this video. Please do give it a thumbs up. I mean, give it a big thumbs up by liking it if you haven't done that yet. And subscribe to my channel, okay? If you haven't subscribed yet. Don't forget, I mean, don't forget to ring on the notification bell so that you'll get notified whenever I drop a new post or a new video now guys please do enjoy other videos in my channel in fact i'm going to attach two playlists on the right and on the left okay so enjoy becky the mommy's channel don't run up don't run up <laughs> thank you for the support bye bye